Hello again, fellow Beach Bum Traders. Have you ever needed or wanted to trade, but you had limited or intermittent internet connectivity and or low bandwidth, like when you were traveling during intermittent powder, power outages, catastrophes like hurricanes, etc.? In this short video, as part of our Tips for Trading While Traveling series, we will share with you some tips that we've discovered in our recent travels with how to trade with limited or intermittent internet connectivity and or low bandwidth. This all reminds me of the not so great old days when we had to use dial up to connect to the internet to conduct business where you wanted to dial up, connect, get your business done as quickly as possible and disconnect as you were often paying by the minute for your internet service and or phone service. Before you travel to an area where you may have limited internet con connectivity and or limited bandwidth, and just in general, we would highly recommend that you ensure that you have all of your trading platforms and tools installed and functioning on a mobile device like your mobile phone just in case you need to execute a trade and do not have internet connectivity at that time. Please note that this also provides you with a great backup in case of power outages where you need to trade during a catastrophe like a hurricane, etc., and you might lose internet connectivity, lose power, etc. In our experience, we have found that the Weeble trading platform seems to perform much better than other trading platforms like Thinkorswim in a low bandwidth environment, particularly the browser based version of Weeble. You can get your copy of Weeble via our affiliate link included in the description box below and get two or more free stocks for yourself. When trading in an environment with limited bandwidth, minimize websites that continuously use up bandwidth or ping the internet like finbizinvesting.com. Therefore, I would recommend closing those browser websites when not in use. If you plan to also work with your email while you are trading in a low bandwidth or intermittent internet connectivity environment, I would recommend only periodically sending and receiving or downloading your email and then working offline to read your emails or compose replies, new emails, etc. Similarly, if you plan to do any social media posting while trading in a low bandwidth or intermittent internet connectivity environment, I would recommend writing your, all your posts offline and then posting them when you have a better internet connection. When you have limited bandwidth to work with, I would highly recommend that you focus your time, energy, and the limited bandwidth you have on your most profitable trading activities. Given that you have limited bandwidth to work with, and each stock in your watch list requires bandwidth to update prices, charts, etc., you may want to consider limiting or shortening the number of stocks in your watch list that you're watching in a real-time basis. If you're working in an environment with inter intermittent internet connectivity, make sure that you save local copies of anything that you're writing or composing online in case of a loss of connectivity while you're composing your text. If you're in an environment where you're at risk of losing your internet connectivity and you are posting something online, Make sure that you save or update often to avoid losing your precious time and effort and work while posting if you happen to lose internet connectivity. If you're also working or collaborating with others, before you travel, 
to an area with limited connectivity or bandwidth, notify your colleagues that there may be potential delays in your responses, and your responses is, may take longer than normal due to your limited internet connectivity. Be prepared that some of your online activities may take longer than usual, and you may have a lower level of productivity while trying to work in an environment with limited bandwidth or limited internet connectivity. Therefore, plan accordingly. Another way to conserve your limited bandwidth is to turn off or temporarily disable any automatic application updates that may be running in the background and consuming your bandwidth while you're trying to trade or work. While trying to trade in an environment where you're at risk of losing your internet connectivity, consider reducing the size of your trades to reduce or minimize your risk of loss should you encounter a loss of internet connectivity while you're trying to trade and the trade moves against you. Also, consider trading less volatile stocks to improve your ability to efficiently get out of a trade at the price you want and to reduce and minimize your risk of loss should you lose internet connectivity or your internet connection is slow due to limited bandwidth. We would highly recommend that you get your exit plans, your stop loss, take profit orders in place in case you lose internet connectivity and your stock starts to run up or down and you're not connected or due to the limited bandwidth. Please see our other previous videos on how to create a stop loss take profit order in Webull and how to create an exit plan in E-Trade. The links of both we will include in the description box below. So what other lessons have you learned and or tips that you're willing to share with your fellow Beach Bump traders regarding how to trade in an environment with limited internet connectivity or limited or low bandwidth and or trying to trade while you are traveling. Please share your lessons learned and tips in the comments included below. Thank you again for watching our video. We hope that you liked it. If so, please smash the like button, give us a thumbs up. If you're not already subscribed, please consider subscribing to our Beach Bum Trading YouTube channel. Please share this video with your fellow traders and friends. And please give us your feedback and any recommendations for improvement in the comments section below. And let us know what else we can do to help you in your trading career. Thank you again. Good luck and have a great trading day.